Well, the Train Bell Resort on North Long Lake in Merrifield is taking winter fun to the next level with ice karting. It's just go-karting, but with a twist. Reporter Charlie Yeager visited the track to get an inside look for this week's Northwoods experience. The sound of the engine might be familiar, but the setting certainly isn't. There's uh, two other places in the uh, country, in the United States, that's doing this, and one is down in Stillwater. There's another company in Aspen, Colorado doing it. Seen it, we just thought it was really cool and something different. So we looked into it and went out and got some carts and started making the track. The track was built using a plow to clear the snow and the carts were purchased secondhand from a fundraiser at the Indy 500. They're a real racing cart. They have crate, Briggs and Stratton spec cart racing motors. So that was a little tricky because we had to set up gearing, clutching, you know, different things like that. In order for these carts to work on the ice though, they needed to be specially equipped with these tires that Eric retrofitted himself to ensure traction on the ice. We actually originally wanted to run these tires that were made for ice, but they're made in Germany and we couldn't get them. So we had to come up with something that was gonna work and we actually decided to go with a Hoosier wet and then modified it you know, with the studs to work on the ice. The idea was simple enough, but a little harder to execute. It was a lot of trial and error at first. We tried different stud compounds, different um, washer sizes. So after those first two weeks of testing, we came up with a one inch stud, half inch washer, then that goes through the tire, and we have another half inch washer and a nylon lock nut. So each rear tire, there's 96 studs, and each front tire, there's 72. The carts can hit speeds of up to 35 miles per hour and drift smoothly around corners all part of the guests' unique experience. It was all super, super fun. I've never done anything like this before. It was a little scary. I get a little, <laughs> those things go really fast, but it was super, super fun. We've had customers that have been here, you know, eight, 10 times since we opened. Once we discovered it, we thought there wasn't anybody in Brainerd doing it. And we thought it would just be a, a, a ton of fun for people to come out and, and get sideways. Reporting from Merrifield with this week's Northwoods Experience, Charlie Yeager, Lakeland News. The Train Bell Resort hopes to keep the track open into March, but that will all depend on whether Mother Nature wants to cooperate. The run as long as the ice is safe to drive on. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.